are still on drug related matters. Drug abuse on Nigeria is at an alarming rate as both male and female, young and old, indulge in the use of various psychotic substances like cannabis, cocaine, heroin, amphetamine type stimulant, and inhalant including solvents such as glue. There are a lot of misunderstandings about the types of drug abuse used and their side effects. Galaxy News correspondent Levi Joseph takes a look at the effects of this trend on the society. A large percentage of Nigeria youth population engage in use of hard drugs like syrup, tramadol, diazepam, cocaine, shisha mix and many more. These drugs create a pleasurable effect that is activated in the brain's reward center. Typically, this area receives the neurotransmitter called dopamine, which is released when we are experiencing a situation or a sensation we find enjoyable. Health, uh, mental health issues arise from substance abuse. So when people use drugs that are not uh, prescribed, they use it for or things other than what it is prescribed for uh, that's abuse and uh, it affects their health and uh, got a lot of problem in the community it's a time bomb that is ready to explode at any time so the situation is getting out of hand one out of every four drug users is a woman and our recent discovery apart from the research, shows that children, young ones, between ages 10 and below, are also into drug use now. Drug use, including drug addiction and trafficking, has a universal ramification that traverses socioeconomic, religious, culture and ethnic boundaries. Nigerian government and National Drug Law Enforcement Agency and the LEA, through policies, have tried to stem its tide in the country, but despite these efforts, there have been a consistent rise in the number of cases, especially among adolescents aged between 10 to 25 years. The situation now is so scary and worrisome because these people now mix even conventional uh, drinks. They mix it with all the, all sorts. There are some the one they call squishies. They use juice or black currant and mix it with uh, cannabis, tramadol, codeine. Sometimes you see people uh, they develop apathy. They are, they don't show interest in life. That's what one of the things drug can cause. So so when people are not interested in anything, you realize that they will become withdrawn. Uh, they become depressed. They now become dependent on those drugs because only the drug creates the world they desire. Though there is no absolute way to prevent abuse of drugs and alcohol, so it is important for everyone to be mindful of how substance abuse develops and avoid temptation and peer pressure. So, so but they don't know that there's a thin line between normal an abnormal. So when you see people uh, trying to jump into Third Mela Bridge, doing all sorts of things, sometimes if you investigate inside, you see that they are using things that are altering their mental uh, abilities. So they can be able to tip off. We talk to the youth. You yourself, speak to yourself as a youth. You can decide, since you have seen what is doing in the lives of other youths, make up your mind, say personal decision, not to get involved. Then parents, Home is the first port of call of a child. Parents, mothers, fathers, jointly raise up your children. Let them know the dangers associated with these drug use. Drugs have a powerful effect on the human brain and the roots of addiction take shape there. In essence, drugs have the capacity to impact how the brain receives signals. It is therefore important to ensure drug abuse and develop the brain mainly on productive activities to maintain good life and better living.